Hello, everyone. Cheshire the Cat on the scene with the finale of Alice in Wonderland. I say that preemptively. I don't know if this actually is going to be the finale or not, but I am pretty sure that we're nearing the end of the game. I will know for sure when I see a specific cutscene. I'm loving this game though, and I'm so happy that I've been able to share this one. I actually forgot this is actually a pretty short game in comparison to how it feels. It just has really difficult boss fights and other stuff. Bravery and I are not on intimate terms. My natural curiosity is tempered with caution. Thus, I've lived long. But now, ignoring my instinct to flee or fib, I speak the truth without regard to consequence. Your courage deserves no less. You've suffered great pain, and you've caused some. You've endured deep grief and feelings of guilt, but you will be tested by a more wrenching anguish, Alice. There is worse to come. You and this Red Queen cannot both survive. You are two parts of the same... <laughs> That's what Alice Redford said in the sequel. Oh yeah, no. Yeah, no. Straight up, off with his head. That was fast. Here we are, yeah. Meet the Red Queen. Who am I? Off with her head. Yeah, oh god. Oh yeah, this fight is no joke. Take a few tries. But I think, yeah, this is it. Who am I? Um, just because. Off with her. So it's not displayed as well in this one, but you can see that it's like a mask coming off. There is a reason why Alice and the Red Queen cannot per se survive in the same instance. can do now is just kind of wait back and forth because this is going to take... I'm going to be saving a lot here. Oh, oh god! Uh, I do really like the like design of this though. Like You can tell this was made by someone who was a part of Team Quake. 
especially when it comes to some of the more eldritch looking monstrosities. But at least the queen follows a pattern, which makes her movements a little easier to predict. Uh. Oh god. Save! Manana! Manana, 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 manana. Did I just win? Nope, stage two. bring this up uh, in between like recordings or something. Oh, that's it! Oh my god! Yeah! I think that's it! Oh. Very short episode. So I guess I'm just gonna tack it on. So... There's a- oh, no, 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 wait, I don't think we're done yet. There's a- Oh. Uh oh. Stage two! I thought that was too easy. Well, there's a hatter. I rule Wonderland alone. Your interference will not be tolerated. This realm is for grown-ups. Raw, well ordered, ruthless, careening on the jagged edge of reality. Self pitying dreamers are not wanted here. They cannot survive here. You fear the truth. You live in shadows. Your pathetic attempts to reclaim your sanity have failed. Retreat to the sterile safety of your self delusions or risk inevitable annihilation. If you destroy me, you destroy yourself. Leave now, and some hollow part of you may survive. Stay, and I will break you down. You will lose yourself forever! Nope. We're not done. Welcome to the Red Queen. Nope, we're not done! We're not done! <laughs> no, God! Oh, God, I can be poisoned here. Okay, well, what was that fun fact you were saying? Um. I didn't want to bring it up during the recording. Just to, uh, screw it. If I if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Well done. Hello. Oh. I guess we get one last weapon for the end of the game. We get a blunderbuss. Um, 
So when um, Alice Madness Returns was getting to be a thing, uh, do I have to hit him in a specific point? They were in the progress of making Alice uh, Otherworlds and had the rights to purchase a movie. Had the rights to a move. Movie. Unfortunately, um. <laughs> Unfortunately, uh, American McGee wasn't able to maintain said rights to movie. And they ended up going to Tim Burton. And they were originally going to be a film adaptation of the series, continuing after the events of the second game. Instead, it got turned into something else. And that got turned into the Alice movies by Tim Burton that we know. That is also why, um, a rather upset, <laughs> and rightfully so, American McGee made the Otherworld series out of his own pocket. Oh boy, am I? I feel like I'm goofing up horribly. So the other worlds uh, still exist. The other world series still exists. I think it's free to watch on YouTube. I have to watch them yet. Sorry if I'm like in and out while I'm focused on this. Wait, am I just steadily losing health being here? Ah. I am just steadily losing health by being here. Hmm, I mean, I kind of wish to work with me. I agree. I f I feel like this would have been a very well done version of the story. Come on. Give me the bits, give me the bits, give me the bits. I'm gonna save because that takes all my health and mana. Whoa. I, I feel like the team could have worked on something very well together. I think what got in the way was EA. Which is why, as far as I know, EA is not a part of, um... And not a part of Asylum. As far as I know, again, don't quote me on that. If you want to fact check for yourself, go for it. Meta energy, that'd be great right about now. Can you imagine, like, a CGI Hell in a Bottom Carter looking like this? Dude, HPC would be down for that. HPC? Oh, Helena Bottom Carter. She. God. Please don't poison me. Ah, no, God. Save. I just 
just soft locked myself. I just soft locked myself. Oh, okay. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I might not have. I might not have. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. We're good. We're good. We're fine. 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 I just realized I have 40 save files in this one game. It's 5 a.m. Right no, it is. It is uh, midnight right now. Not 50 save files, 40, pi 40 pages of save files. Oh! Welcome to how difficult this game is. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Oh, crap. Ugh, why? Okay, we're good. Did we do it? Did we do it? Did we do it? Keep going. Was that it? We're still here. We're still here. Why are we still here? Okay, we're just loading. Oh god, those are pixels. But that's it. Look, Griffin's alive again. Further beyond. <laughs> so, there. Everyone is alive again. Turtle's back. The white rabbit is back. Our friend the Griffin is back. The Cheshire Cat is alive once more. Everyone is alive again. Because we fixed Wonderland. Happily ever after. And that's it! We leave the asylum! <laughs> wow! That's it! That's the end of American McGee's Alice. Oh, this has been one of the most difficult games. Like, I played this in high school, and I absolutely fell in love with the storytelling. 
but I like how it ends with her just leaving the asylum. That's it. And it's just like this big happily ever after moment. Like, everything is fine. Wonderland is back together. She's awake from her coma. She has her kitty cat. And she's able to move on with her life. Eleven years later. <laughs> so, for context in terms of storyline, this actually follows directly into Madness Returns. Which I will be playing and recording another time. <laughs> uh, but that was it. That was it. This is uh, this makes me so happy that I was able to share this game with you guys. Uh, like, you have no idea. Soon? Soon. Like, like, literally the next thing that happens is she goes out and fights... The woman that worked as the maid for the little mansion. And her therapist. Her uh, psychology therapist. And that is what leads to her, like, feeding pigeons on rooftops. And uh, the working for... <sighs> working for the therapist in the sequel game. It literally just goes straight into that. Um, she gets her hair cut, she gets a new dress, and that's about it. Or, no, she doesn't get a new dress, she just, she just, yeah, she's just there. Ah, uh, but what an adventure. And for the folks on YouTube, this is going to be Cheshire the Cat, signing off, and I will see you guys in the next series. Till then, take care, ta-ta for now.